Hello and welcome, Rufus. Don't you take dump right now? To episode 181 of Double Life, where we're in the backyard working on uh, backyard things, backyard things. But we have a surprise. Hello, finally. Are you excited? Steve has come back to Brian's house. Yes. <laughs> The backyard for the first time with the fence. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Rufus. And Rufus. I, like Rufus. I already like, I love Rufus. He's, He's a good puppy. Him. He's yes. a good puppy. So we're going to get into some antics with Steve. This is Easter weekend for us. Uh, so we'll have Steve here for the next 18-ish hours. Yep. We got some other stuff to do. We're going to go see uh, Morbius tomorrow night, the girls and I. And then we're going to visit my folks for Easter. So busy episode. Busy episode. I have challenges for Steve, which will be exciting. Like lay out bricks, no problem. <sighs> and that's just regular, like part of real life. That's not interesting. We are laying out bricks. Let me show you. So lots of places around the house we're putting these borders with gravel. Uh, just to clean it up, kind of flower bed, gravel bed. And a big part of that is because Rufus likes to dig. He likes to dig. We're gonna put a patio here for uh our patio furniture that you see there, pollen covered. We're gonna put like a grill pad here in front of this bed so we can grill. And then over here, we're gonna have a little fire pit area uh, with chairs. Somewhere there may be a place to tan out. And then we're also gonna put a little brick border. And I have a feeling Natalie's gonna wanna do something in front of this bricks other than just the bricks. I'm just looking at it going, she's gonna change that, I believe. Um, but we don't want, Rufus likes to dig and we don't want him to dig under the fence. So we're trying to be prohibitive. I'll let you see the wonderful fence. What are you going to do back there? Not sure yet. Maybe gravel. Maybe who knows what in the back by the pine straw. Unknown TBD. Unknown. Uh, but that's probably all you're going to see of back here. But Steve has run away. Rufus! 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 You got to take a donk? Oh, he's peeing. Oh, TT. Good boy. Anyway, it is 535. We have kickboxing at 630. Steve wants to go to kickboxing. And again tomorrow morning to kickboxing. Yeah, I'm just I'm looking at the mighty four. Let's let's see some of the things we've picked up recently. So this is a lot of legions I picked up on Macari. Steve, what do you think this character's name is? Uh, if you had to guess, um, Lucius. Belphegor, but I thought you picked Bezelbob. Yeah. But a lot of mythic legions. Uh, you'll see some of the stuff in a hunt video, or you just saw it in a hunt video. I did find the Thor wave. So we need Jane and Gore for our MCU collection. This is the Kong Studios uh, Vegeta, but specifically we want that because it's got the Ultra Ego Vegeta head in there. I got this from GameStop, Power Rangers Foot Soldier. I got Bronx that you saw in the hunt video. Oh, yeah. Good Bronx. A pig. <laughs> or the Pudgy the pig. pig. I think it was on Amazon for like 12 bucks. I think it was Amazon. These look really... These actually do look I was really like, good. it's a pig with, a, like, a gladiator helmet. Yeah. And then I got old Doodle oh. Man. Are you excited Clayface. for Doodle Man? I saw Clayface at, um... It was some kind of store. Big Doodle big. Man. He's big, yeah. yeah. he's thick. So those are the things I picked up. But Steve wants to show us something he's picked up yeah. right away. Rufus, you want to... Oh, that's your butt. What's that, Steve? Yeah, the Beast Kingdom Darkwing Duck. Oh. Which... I was very intrigued. I got a really good deal for it at the battleground, so I was like, "All right, I'll just go." Well, that's ahead rare. And try it, yeah. Well, actually, something that's not been wide released yet. I found it on eBay for retail. Scrooge McDonald's. I don't think I knew that they were like. So I bought those are the dynamic action heroes. Yeah. yeah. So I I was like the first person I know that bought any of those. I had the original Justice League right when they started that line, mm -hmm. but I didn't know they were making the Disney. Yeah. They, there's also the nephews and. But I don't have it. Huh. So. That's actually pretty cool. Yeah, it looks real good, yeah. Does it come with the pit of money? If they make a pit of money accessory diorama, you have to buy it with, like, the diving board? Yeah, I agree, but I've never seen a... Uh, pit of money? Like that, yeah. That's cool. I'd be interested to see what they compare to, like, the Super Summons. You got both of these at Battlegrounds? No, nah, this was at Battlegrounds. This That's was on eBay. eBay. Someone was $15? No. A little bit more than that? Uh, it, it was about... Kai's like, I don't know what that is. I just want to go back to moving brick. I'm trying to get off punishment. <clears throat> I watched DuckTales. Steve, I have a challenge for you. All right. Moving so we're, we're about to go... No, that's I'm just... That's, no, no, that's just like what we do to help each other. The... Um, we're going to kickboxing. Uh-huh. 
So our kickboxing instructor asks, he's like, oh, is that that guy that's come before? He's going to come tonight? I was like, yeah. Uh, I think you know Anthony. And so oh, yeah. he, 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 he commented on there. He's like, oh, great, Steve. I'm like, oh, great. Oh, did he? <laughs> yes. It was Anthony that commented? Yes. So then he was like, well, that, isn't Steve do like challenges and stuff? And I was like, yeah, yeah. So the challenge that we have, it, it, it is for a guaranteed action figure. I'm not telling you what action figure, but you do earn an action figure for this challenge. It's a twofold challenge. So we're going to start off. We're each going to have pre-workout. You're going to have the uh, Broken Arrow Cryo Edition with a little topper of the maple bacon, of course, the pump. Oh, not that again. Oh. <laughs> but we'll actually mix it into water. Oh. But then your workout attire is this uh, Eeyore Winnie the Pooh onesie. You've so got to be hot. kidding me. Fully zipped up. Oh, my God. For the whole workout. So I look so hot in that. Well, hey! It's going to be so hot. You do I know it's going to be hot. I mean, this thing is like... Are you accepting this challenge? I'll accept the challenge. Yay! Gosh, this is I will be wearing my normal kickboxing stuff, but I have already went to kickboxing once today. So that's my challenge. And I'm going to be having the so, explosive pumps nuclear workout sour gummy. I've never had either of that. It does. Um, it says explosive on there. Ooh, well, walking like he's got a dog. So I have to like mix these together. And yeah, I'll make it for you. I'll make it oh, for you. So I'll make it for you. Uh, I'll make our pre-workout. We'll drink it here in about 20 minutes. And... And you got to wear the, the onesie the whole workout. And you want an action figure. I have a second challenge as well. Would you like to already know what the second challenge is? I thought these were the two challenges. You no, uh, uh, for an action figure. I have a sec for a second action figure. For a second action figure. Yes. Yes. Both of which I do believe you will like. Is it Mighty Thor? No. That's Kaya's. Okay. You don't want that anyway. I'm trying to no, take I don't. I really don't. So you're trying to take you to get on punishment. Yeah. One moment, so I've got to I gotta deliver. Hold on, one moment. Since Steve missed all the Toy Lana fun, uh -oh. no. I've got three items uh -oh. that you need to consume to win the second action figure. This is why I didn't eat much lunch because I knew that it was going to be bad. And you can go ahead and do this one to win the first action figure. Oh! I got three containers. Oh! Chinese food sweet and sour sauce. Oh, oh, gross. Oh. It's not expired. No, it's recent. Mm. It's just like a day old. But this is but this is like and I you could if you would like something to dip it with it, you can have these <laughs> bear <laughs> baked crunchy Fuji's and Reds apple chips. Oh, God. So is that required? And I'll buy and I'll buy your dinner. Is that required? No, no, no. You don't. It, I, if you just want to drink it and like tongue it, you can do it. <laughs> yeah, all, right, all right. That's the path he's going. Oh, he's going. He's going. He's going. Oh. So Steve was so hot drinking the stuff. He's already had two. You saw the video froze there at the end, but the audio continued. So you saw him drink one. He's got one left. I made him stop. He got frustrated because he was there. He was where he needed to be. All right. He's ready. He's ready. All right. Kill it. Do I want to like drop it in or something? Like oh, would you like a slow mo? Yeah, let's try yes. a slow mo. Let's drop it in. Go ahead, Steve. It's not empty. And you haven't oh, tongued it quite yet. Oh, oh, but I mean, no, I thought it was completed. I mean, it's not it. empty. Look, that's standing liquid. That, that's, you you know, could that, still dip some chicken in there. Oh, you got to use the tongue a little bit. You know. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, consolidation. That's important. Oh. It's like medicine. We've got kickboxing in uh, 51 minutes, 41 minutes. Oh. <laughs> Steve, yep. you want T no. or B? No, you've won one prize. You want T or B? So like it's, a, it's like... Like T and the B. You want T or B? Oh, 
Which one do you want first? Not in the B. So you want T, and then you earn B with the onesie? Yeah, because In case you fail at one, do you want the T or the B? Wearing a donkey outfit is like getting in the B. So you want the T? Go look for the T. Yeah, I guess. I'm going to get him the T. I'm going to get him the T. Where's the T? You win that. Oh! Do you have that? No! Yay! That looks like it fits in your oh. collection. The Very Arts Iron Man. Yeah, it's like the Final Fantasy stuff. Yeah, Iron Man. he's I mean, cool. It is cool. You don't have, and you don't have an Iron Man with a whatever that is. She. Yeah. Yeah, you win the tea. Yay! And Rufus likes his shovel. Yeah. Oh, oh so yay! The, so the T and the B was the prop. Yeah, there's a T prize. That's T for Tony, oh, and there's the a B prize. So the B is the doing that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you'll win B when you do that. Yeah, look at that butt. You thought B is for butt? That's where Rufus is. <laughs> oh, I'm worried, Steve, about the feet. I didn't realize that had footies. <laughs> we'll do that again. Show everybody the love. My concern is that that's not going to be the greatest for jumping and kicking. Right? It's got some, like, grip on the bottom. I mean, do you think you're going to be able to jump and kick without, like, tearing an ACL? Or would you rather have one that your feet come out the bottom? I have I this pink unicorn oh, no. where the feet actually come out the bottom of the holes. No. You'd rather you, you, you'd be that one, you're just going to be ginger? Yeah, I'll just I'll do that. Because I'm not wearing shoes for kickbox anyways. Right? So you feel comfortable? Yeah, right. Yeah. I didn't know if you want your bare feet on the ground. No. You're, you think those are, that'll suffice? That's, yeah, it's like socks? Yeah. yeah. Rufus is <laughs> He's very happy about the situation. That's what I'm making for Steve. Maple bacon hailstorm. And I'm having that. I gotta make it fast. Run out of time. Cheers. Cheers. He's, see how it tastes. <laughs> Is it good or not, no, good? It's not good? We gotta chug it. We gotta leave in one minute. Might taste like gum worms. Mm. <laughs> Apparently does not taste like gummy worms. <laughs> As we were exiting the neighborhood, there were kids at like the, the little playground and the pool. And they're just staring. I'm like, why is there a man in the Eor driving? Where could he possibly be going? And then you say kickboxing, you know. Oh, do you think there's anyone else on planet Earth tonight going to a kickboxing session in an, a onesie? An Eeyore onesie. I be no, I believe there is. That has just had maple bacon pre-workout. That's got to be pretty niche. Yeah, but I, I mean... But somebody's probably in a onesie somewhere. Somewhere, kickboxing. probably, yeah. But maybe not maple bacon onesie. Black Under Friday special. Circumstances. To earn no. a B. I'm 40 years old and I'm wearing an Eeyore suit. <laughs> kickboxing. Do you... What kind of midlife crisis? So you always know when there's two challenges, you actually have the the premeditated, like, bigger part of the challenge. So do you think the, the what was about a, probably three quarters of a cup of sweet and sour sauce combined with whatever, the pump and the pre-workout in the tummy combined with the heat over an hour-long cardio workout, what do you think that's going to do to the insides? Good. You think you just need to wear a bucket like a donkey actually does, <laughs> so you can just hurl in the bucket? Uh, maybe. Kickboxing, ho! Obviously, I can't really film us kickboxing because I need a kickbox. But I'm gonna make, I'm gonna film Steve doing something. And, I mean, and then we'll catch up. I mean, but we gonna see something, some squats, little... something. I have absolutely no idea what I'm about to walk into. <laughs> well, Steve, are we excited? <laughs> Here, I'm going to show you. Take this off. Uh -huh. Patty pull the bottom. Teaching Steve that he gets you a pull the bottom off and you put it on top. And make a sandwich. Just to add to uh, the uh, three so good. The three fourths of a cup of sweet and sour sauce that he had to chug. Here, I'm going to take this piece for you. Oh, he also good. had the maple bacon pre workout now and pull another the bottom off. <laughs> Actually, I have done it, this before. And some yeah, put it in the mouth. And then put it on top and make a little... Mm -hmm. Oh, you go. are you going all at once? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs>
Ah, yes, Steve, yeah. Yeah, Steve, yeah. Yeah, Steve, yeah. Oh, look at that honey. Woo, curtsy squat. Uh-oh, Steve, we're down in a onesie. All right, I gotta go actually work out now. Yeah, we're in the plank, Steve, as a onesie. How's it feeling? <laughs> Come on, get some elevation. Yes, throw them hands in the air. Woo! Oh, cinematic mode, cheeks. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, climb it, Steve. Yeah, yeah, climb it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Woo! How's this feeling right now? Oh, How's so your temperature? Bad. Oh, it's so bad. It's so bad. For the B! Hey! All right, Steve Murphy. Let's go. Ready? Go. Oh, yeah, deeper, Steve. Yeah, deeper. Yeah. Oh, crunches. Oh, crunches. Oh, crunches. Yeah, you're tapping. Tapping it. Tapping it. The perfect burpee, Steve. Flawless, perfect burpee, go, perfect form. Everything you got, boop, boop, oh! Huh. Uh. Uh. The warm up is over. I taste so good when it hits the lips. Would you like some? Like, no. Here, have a little water. How you feeling in there? We get to stretch now. Are you excited for that? I don't know. Thanks for feeling, noticing me. I ain't feeling too good right now. Feeling real sweaty. What you got underneath there? No, uh, I don't Oh! Let's not do that. Steve, you're missing the stretch there, buddy. Sorry, I'm not mentally. You're not where you need to be. Yeah, stride it out. You know, ride out. Stride it. I am not currently stretching. I'm looking at, you know, that. Ooh. So Steve, as we loosen up the loins for the kickboxing, how are you feeling? Are you glad I'm filming this experience so you can live it forever? Would you recommend others do this? No. You're out on that? Totally. I bet you're very sweaty in the taint area, yeah? Yeah, Steve, yeah, yeah, yeah. Boom, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, here it comes. Oh, here it comes. I got you, Rock. I got you. I got you, Rock. I got yeah. you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Kick it. Yeah. Oh, kick it. Oh, you got to switch it, Steve. You got to switch it. Yeah, yeah. Kick it. Oh, yeah. Kick it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, package. How you feeling? I'm tired and I was filming like 10% of the workout. I feel like Piglet could win right now. Piglet could win? Oh, yes. We got to stretch now, Steve. We got to stretch. And you loosen up the butt cheeks. This thing smells so bad, dude. <laughs> Probably never been washed Like, ever. I opened this up like, oh! God, it smells so bad. Hairless stretching. Got to get loose. It's one of the worst things ever. <laughs> we'll talk to you when we get in the car. It's, it's, it's really... <laughs> Real bad. I hate this so much. How's the sweet and sour sauce cupcake maple bacon treating you? Cool. Steve, do you think the uh, police are here? Because someone uh, called in. There's, there's a man in a onesie that just walked into children's karate class. He's looking at me right now. It's not going to be a good story to tell my wife. Oh, I got pulled over by the police. Why? Well, well, we're talking the police are staring right at Steve in the onesie. We could have went that way and been home. We're still in the parking lot because Steve is literally going like out to the side. Like I ain't getting pulled over in an Eeyore onesie with ball sweat. Yeah. Yeah. Like so, when I like when I first sat in the chair, 
all the droplets of sweat pressed against my body with the thing, and it was disgusting. So it did you so did you enjoy yourself? No, I didn't. Are you glad it's over? Yeah. Are you excited to see what the B is before you take a shower? I don't know if I'm more excited for the B or for the shower. <laughs> Ooh, B coming up next. Steve, we're home. Rufus is excited to see Eeyore. Hey, don't forget to use the hashtag BDubFit. I forgot to mention that. If you want to join us for things like this. Steve, are you excited to see what the B is? Sure, yeah. So. How hot was it? Oh, my gosh. I, I got to take this off. I'm, are you going to unzip oh. it right here? No, I'm not. No. You can be in the nude. The, um, so, since Steve's life has gotten much more busy and he doesn't get to collect quite as much, right? And he's always on the road and more traveling and, and with coaching. And I thought I'd get him something that he can bring with him, have at his desk and play with, have on the school bus and play with, but still be a premium level toy that I think he will enjoy. So the B is the three zero little baby bumblebee, oh. which is an incredible toy. It is incredible. And you can bring you can have in your pocket. Bring it to track meets, football games. Three zero is high quality stuff. Yeah, so there's your B. Was that worth? Uh, it, it's literally the B. Yeah. When we got there, <laughs> the owners of the school were greeted us and made him force feed a cupcake. They just got in on the fun right away. Like Miss Patty Ann just said, "Here's cupcake. Eat it." Oh no! Yeah. Is that true, Steve? Yes. Those are good prizes, yeah? yeah that's it. Yes, this is. Winner! Shower time? Yes. Well, we're at Home Depot, Steve. Is this <laughs> what you were looking forward to after the workout? Uh, not exactly. We need some more pavers, so Steve's... Uh... <laughs> Poor Steve. He's a good sport. Home Depot, and I got you the truck and move it over here. We had to get more of those pavers that you saw for the fire pit. Uh, because the original configuration we had was just slightly too small. We want to space, space it out a little bit more so there's room to have the two chairs there, the fire pit, a little like middle table, you know, that type of thing. And so we can just, you know, sit and chill by the fire. So that's exciting. That's exciting. I like a fire pit. So it'd be nice to have that set up. And then we've got to get some other, a bunch actually, of big stones that uh we're here but they were like buried in pallets and we're here like an hour before they close so too much of a pain in the butt if you didn't know we learned this uh during all this in the last couple days natalie learned it you can buy like these bricks pavers and stuff and that you can just bring the barcode a picture of the barcode they'll put it in you pay for it and you bring your car around and they'll load it for you and that's helpful when you're doing something like buying 200 bricks or you know, 50 of something that weighs 40 pounds each. Uh, like, it really helps. Uh, I guess I kind of knew that for contractors. I didn't realize you could do it as a regular customer. And I think you can even order ahead online and do curbside uh, pickup like that. So, lesson. I hate going to Home Depot, so I've never learned the efficiencies of Home Depot. But that's good to know. Good news. We can just uh, go to the NECA Funko section. Like, that's Steve's request, right? After all this, the yeah, NECA sure, Funko yeah. section. Yeah. yeah. There's a Target. Are we excited for Target? Yes. That's a no. Steve is on the hunt. He wants the light green Turtles 4-pack from the Holothon, kind of. He's interested in it. He'd like to at least see if it's here. I saw it here last time I was on a hunt here, four or five days ago. They had like three or four of them. So it's the only place I've seen it recently. So that's uh, yeah. what we're going to do. What do you think, Kai? Walking like you got a dump, apparently. You got a dump? No. Steve! You're not going to be optimistic and bring a basket? You want to be optimistic and get a basket? Would you like to wear that swimsuit right there, Steve? Are you glad that wasn't the challenge? Yes. Steve, does your Target have this Disney store section in it? Yeah. You like it? Is this the I need a new butt section? <laughs> we talked about that story in class. The I need a new butt? Yes. Well, the butt, Easel Jr. Oh, Steve's apparently going in on the I need a new butt. What's it about? Like people are different? What? Yeah, they banned it because they send a kid home without dinner. So that's something I don't want yes. to be talking about. Of course. Nana loves you more than Jimmy Fallon. Sometimes it's dark. You know? 
I mean, there's a there's like a movie of that. Dragons of Tacos. This book is banging because um, I, that sounds like too serious for dub life. So we're running away to look at action figures. I don't know what they talking about. We're looking for some Star Wars. Over here is the Star Wars. There's Raya. Every time in this Target, people just stare at me. There's this thing. Is that a paddle? Is that an Ana? Oh, it's a brush. That guy's just standing there. I thought it was a paddle at first. Thought it was a paddle, but it's not. Scout troopers. Same mess that's always here. These carbonized things that are ridiculously priced. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Stay! Come on! Come on. Come on. All right. Steve don't care. Steve don't care. He's going to miss out. Uh-oh, Steve. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, I'm looking at these, all these that I just bought yesterday for five dollars. They're also going to be here. I wonder what this moss man rings up as. Hold that for me. All right, Cam Vernon doesn't belong there. Let's get a better box. This one's a little beat up. I just want to see what they ring up as. I'm going to check that too. Okay. All right. So I wonder if there's a sprite. Oh. Hold her. We're going to see what she rings up as. That's all Makari. We have a million. Looking for a Sprite or Kingo? Fastos. Where'd y'all go? Y'all disappeared. Yeah. yeah, you want them? That's wonderful. Oh, here's the boss, man. I know. I want to see how much that rings up. Do you have the Hype Hair Floral Frenzy? Nope. Okay. You want the... Ooh! I see the holothon set up over there. Double There's 75,000 people in this oh, aisle. We're just gonna have to, oh, no, just gonna have to go over here and look at the Super Soaker XP 30 AP. Nope. Well, they were up there. Now the frog, the frogs weren't here though. So it's possible they relocated. Rat King. I know there's always a section where like rain. Yeah, there's multiple. Stick it in the in the basket. <laughs> There's the ultimate gremlin, female gremlin. No signed fugitoid. Steve, here's the signed RuPaul Chia Pet, I think. No, nope, not signed. Do I want that? I don't. Pikachu V. We've already got that. We don't need that. There's no cards over here we're interested in. Oh, Piggy! Yeah, that. You could get Judith Magical. You want the piggy? No. No? You want the WandaVision? Mm -hmm. Absolutely not. Under no circumstances, Kaya, no. Oh, look, it makes a rocket ship. <laughs> There's the poop gun. <gasps> it doesn't work. Turn up. Oh. It's not a real one, though, so it doesn't count. It doesn't count. All right. Steve has found Coronation Star Scream. Yes. You want Coronation Star Scream? I, I already have it. I just haven't done anything with it. This is, this is the single most people that I have ever seen in a Target figure section. Oh. Are you talking to me? I don't know what I'm do for surgery. Batman. The Loki. Helicopter thing. Oh, yeah, I've never seen I do not. I have a million gun no. Well, I have one, but he's the one that would have had the bats and the alley vipers. Mm. Lady J. Uh, he's been here for a while. Mm. Steve's going somewhere else. Steve's not waiting. He's dipping. He's dipping. Kai, he's dipping. Oh, dear. Legends. There's nothing there. I'm going away. I'm fleeing. There's too many people looking at action figures in this target. 50 people in the figure out. You scoping it out, Steve? Too many people. Just by casually staring at action figures. Probably thinking about, can I sell this on eBay? Can I make some money? Answer's no. Well, the answer might be maybe, but nothing I've seen here is money worthy. And somebody must have bought the four pack. Muck Everlasting, Rat King, Wingnut, and Screw Loose. That four pack is pretty obvious too. It would be hard to hide somewhere. Inflatable lounge chair. Yes, please. You need the inflatable lounge chair? Darth Vader, the Witcher, big pen. 
Uh, gunslinger. All right, we need to go scan these things, see what they ring up as. Scanning it. You're interested in this, but Steve, there's the little oh, dance dance revolution. With the fingers. Oh, oh, wow. Would you play that? E, 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 e. Could you imagine? We could put what kind? We could put Ninja Turtle in there and play it. Oh, that's true. You could use it for uh, for scale. That's true. I don't think I got down to this aisle because there were so many people. We stopped there. Kaka! So, is that the normal Cody? Is that the normal color? I know the red is the Walmart, but is that the color the normal one was? That looks different to me. Maybe not. China. Oh, this is Series 8. Moxley, Chuck Taylor, Santana Ortiz, Orange Cassidy, Marriott. Evil, and we want to see how much those are, but the, none of the scanners like are here. They're all like empty. Triclops, Orco, Hurricane. No, uh, no, but ultimate, but Steve stuff. I did a very prominent. Where are these Pikachu? The I heard it. I heard the cacao from the. From the, other side of the you brought it from down under. Oh, we didn't yeah. even go down the side. We didn't at all. Uh. Look at all that Pikachu. I just want to find out if those things are $5 or not, Steve. Do a little dance. Ow. Oh, we can't find a scanner that works. And honestly, I don't need to buy any more of those Eternals. I bought so many last time. But Steve's getting a Atari Mini that you play with your T-Tilly Tinky. Well, it's actually the joystick button actually works and everything. So that's a yes. And it's, yeah, it's actually. Yeah, see, yeah. I don't have a super need for it, but I still just fun. Kind of want to have, yeah. wanna have it. And that's I mean, that's what all this crap is. And we don't have a need for any of it. No. Just want to play. No. I got to pee. That is quite the line, Steve. Well, I'm gonna pee and find out if Steve meets me at the front or waits ten you're, hours. You're gonna use the temporary bathroom. Oh, it's outside. It's outside. I'm gonna wait till we get to the restaurant. Me too. Hmm. I'm choosing not to wait. I mean, it smells awful in here, but this may be the nicest portable bathroom I've ever seen. Successfully peed and Steve got his Atari. So it wasn't a wasted trip. Now it's time to eat. Yeah. Taco Mac? Yeah. Taco Mac. Yeah, you're good with that, Steve? Yeah. Taco Mac had too long a wait. So now we're at Wild Wing Cafe. And if Wild Wing Cafe fills us, we're going to Waffle House. Yep. Steve's gonna get the all-star special, aren't you? Maybe. Are you gonna get the chili fries? You walking like you got a dump. Got a little waggle to you, Steve. Sore. How do you think kickboxing is gonna be in the morning? Awful. It is very loud in here. Oh. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Barracuda. late night so all we can order is wings so we're just going to get 50 wings yeah. 10 different flavors yeah. right. you, and Steve right. you want the brave heart sting so hot you lose your head over it uh, oh. i just had to go tt and i was in there tt and a gentleman had an explosive situation in the stall i mean it was like and somebody was washing their hands at the same time. <laughs> and it's not a motion detector switch. Switch. So as he walked out, he just instinctively turned the lights out in the bathroom like he was leaving his bathroom at home. <laughs> and the guy that was having the situation, I just heard. <laughs> oh. Well, this is not the most beat up fit. But uh, Steve earned it, right, Steve? In oh, fact, yeah. I made a little trailer of Steve's antics that even though you just watched it all, I'm going to put a little trailer here for him, Steve. You think they'll enjoy it? I think Maybe? I think they will, too.
Did you enjoy it? The little Bollywood trailer? Ooh. All the debacle? All right, we're gonna eat. Steve and I will do something else when we get home. It's not very fit. I gotta, I gotta go light. But there's only, uh, literally the only thing you can order wings and fries. Oh well. Better than all. Good. I know it's dark out, so you probably can't see it, but there we go. Space where you can sit right here in the rocking chairs and relax. And you can adjust the fire pit closer or further away or slide your chairs as needed. And still fire pit patio. I think that'll be lovely. Mm -hmm. Hi, Rufus. You got the ball? Hey, buddy. Yes, yes. I know. You want hey, You want me? Oh, that's right. The package. So some of the stuff I may open later in this video, I may not. But I think Steve and I are going to open up this. Scrooge McDuck and Darkwing Duck. We're not going to unbox it here. We're going to open it up and then show you what it looks like. And I don't know if you'll open any of that, but I think we'll open this up now. Here's the Scrooge McDuck. Yeah, it does have a stand, a little stand arm. It's a normal Beast Kingdom stand. It's not just the hands, but so. He's pretty big sized. I mean, so here's a Mythic Legion, kind of a, a, a large scale 112. So he's definitely like a 1 6th type of. I mean, maybe one eighth or one ninth, but he is much bigger than what you want it to be, I think. So you can see it. What's that in there? You got like, oh, his scales with money. He's got money, a map, money, bag, hat. Is that soft goods? Oh, soft goods in it. Sorry, Mr. Kane. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get him in a little pose, Steve. Yeah, you got the little insert. Oh, find, find your, your fortune. fortune. There's Steve's pose with a little Scrooge. Are those glasses, are they attached to the, the beak? Yeah, they're molded completely. Molded? Yeah, like one ultimate head. You can't change any other parts on there, which you can for the dark one. So we'll check there. it out on the dark wing. I wonder if they're interchangeable too. I bet, I bet you could put the Scrooge head on the dark wing. We will find Probably. out here shortly. Oh yeah. He's cool. He is, he's very cool. And you know, you can, I'm gonna take that off this con. I mean, he has, it's a good quality white tone. Yeah. I mean, if you want to hold him. You know. This set feels similar to Egg Attack, Beast mm -hmm. Kingdom product. Yeah. It's nice. Looks good. Nice hind in there. It's a little hard to stand, but I mean, you can, I mean. Because it's, is it because the legs are? Yeah, you can, there's yeah. no articulation in these. Like, yeah. It's just the same. And they're, they're kind of small compared to the rest of his body, but that's the character design. I mean, right. it is what it is. All right. All right. But you got his first ever dime. There. Well, well, let's you want know, to do some size comparisons. Here's Scrooge, also, uh, Scrooge McNuck next to a Mythic Legions. Yes. And here he is next to Doodoo Man, Clayface. Do you think the Doodoo Man looks good? Mm hmm. Do you think I should keep that in the bathroom with all the walls of poops and stuff? And people go in, they're like, oh, what's that? So there's plenty of people that come to this house and use the bathroom that have no idea what Clayface is. Plenty. What are you whipping out there? Are you going to put that alternate head in your mouth and act like no. you're a Scrooge McDuck? No. No. Give it a kiss. Ooh. Here's the little uh, thing that Steve bought, the little mini arcade. And uh, Clayface keeps losing. He's having a little rage quit fest of his Atari. He's displeased. He was trying to change the heads, but the neck peg is pretty difficult to deal with. So I'm not sure that we're gonna do that. But we got the Darkwing Duck open. Here's his accessories, his gun. Oh, he just changes the beak. That's good. So what is Cons eyes. These are eyes. Yeah, but you don't have to take the whole head off. No. Uh, all right, he looks really good too. I mean, obviously they're probably the exact same body. Oh, this one has double jointed. He doesn't have articulation on his knees. Yeah, he doesn't have a two guys to knees, but he does. does. Yeah. yeah, ankles and knees. These That's are very. Interesting. And the Darkwing yeah, came first. Uh, or you don't know. Yeah, Darkwing came first. It's the first wire release. Yeah. So he's before Scrooge. Yeah. But he has more articulation. It's interesting. So he could be more dynamic. More dynamic, Steve. Whip him out. Let's get him in a pose. He can touch it. What do you think about that? Huh? Darkwing. Mm-hmm. You think he's gonna take on Belfagor here? Good. You think he wins in that? Uh, no. Uh, <laughs> if we're talking about Toon Universe versus whatever that universe is from, no. No? Uh, He's cool. I like the grappling hook. Yeah. 
And so you can change out his masks and Yeah, so like apparently if you want to have a closed mouth, you got Are you a closed mouth fan or open mouth? Open mouth is more action. Yeah. You know. Different, different eyes, more like he's squinting. Like, Ooh la la. Or yeah, or it's wide open. Yeah. Those are cool. They are. It's very cool. It's very, very cool. Huh. Thanks for bringing those. I, I I didn't even know they exist. And there's a Sorcerer Mickey. Do you know if there's any others in this lot of the Disney stuff? Donald, there's a Donald Duck. Um, there's the the nephews. The nephews are there. For too. Headless Scrooge? Yes. Um, I was going to say, let's try his head on him, but no, nope. No, let's not do no. that. Nope. Yeah. Well, that's cool. Well, we're going to play with toys for a little while before we go to bed, but mm -hmm. uh, we'll check back in tomorrow when we have kickboxing again. Are you excited for that? Mm-mm. <laughs> I told a little bit of Phil we opened a bunch of stuff so I thought I'd show you we've got the Red Ranger and Tommy is the Foot Soldier 2 pack, Raphael the Red Ranger we opened up Bronx and the Goliath's Wings which obviously we haven't put on Goliath yet we got Gore the God Butcher, that's all it comes with very plain uh, the Jane looks excellent she also comes with an unmasked head we opened up this Pudgy the Pig who I like very much. The Farm April and Casey 2 pack, I mean, whatever. <laughs> Not necessary. Maybe. It is cool that she can hold the drawings and the pencil. That is cool. But, I mean, how many times are we just gonna keep doing that? Mm -hmm. The Toon, Toka, and Razor, which look great. They have this meat. This meat probably needs to go pudgy in the mouth, you know? Mm -hmm. um, the Future Toy looks exceptional paint on this guy amazing and then the robotic bebop and rock steady also look really good yeah like that like oh give it to me put it in my mouth so now it's time for bed it's a couple hours later but we decided to go ahead and open some stuff and uh, play around a little bit so that was fun good morning it's the next morning rufus and i are awake hey rufus it's rainy outside which is always the worst with the puppy because he likes to go roll around in it and whatever. We're going to try to go to kickboxing again this morning. Body feels a little bad. Uh, I got all my stuff there. I don't have a lot of homes for all this. But there is one thing. So I have this big package. You can see how big it is. And this comes from our friend Nick Dubes. mo 2 Dubes on Instagram. Uh, you saw his table of Master Universe Mythic Legions customs uh, extensively. At Toylana, and David and Ron, Century Mad Collector, Dark Collectibles, and I made a purchase from Nick, and uh, he took them back to his place, uh, did some extra work and whatever, and now they have arrived. And I have not opened this box yet because I want to open it on camera. Oh, there's a little note. Thanks again for the support. Sorry it took so long. It didn't take so long. Want to include something special so you each have a bag with shoelace ornaments and spirit faction shields. Hope you like the packaging. Enjoy adding these guys to your collection. So, I want to add these guys to my collection. Um, so, I'm going to, well, you know, let me show you. <laughs> yes, Rufus? Look, other people are here. Steve, give us a little shake. No, I can't. <laughs> yes. Rufus. <laughs> Squeaks from Rufus is going to be happening. So here's the spread from Motu Dubes. All these customs, and you see, mythics of the universe. He even customized the box. They have a, a, a sigil art of the figure itself on the side, and even down the packaging, he has the artwork. So I'm going to go over them. I'm going to try to show you all of these guys. They're just absolutely incredible i mean they all have a name they've all been named it's a triclop and i got those two guys open but his packaging is so cool it's hard for me to to say oh let's uh he signed them it's hard for me to not just say leave them in package because the packaging is is amazing all this hard work on it that guy is cool. Oh, that's the guy with the big wings. Bone wings. Fisto. This is a spike war. Oh my God. 
Skeletor. Ram Man. We got Buzz Off. And Two Face. And even these, you see, all the packaging. It's made custom. Uh, so, Nick, dude, you're the man. He also sent us some bonus goodies, some shields, some shoelace ornaments that have the that sigil on them. Shields do. Very, very, very cool. I have to actually give stuff to David and Ron, which makes me sad because I can't keep it all for myself. But these are incredible. So follow him, Motu, M-O-T-U-D-O-O-B-S on Instagram. Uh, you'll see me posting this haul video on my Instagram. You can find it. Shout out to Nick because these are beyond expectations. And I've seen all these figures in person already. And they're even beyond my what my expectations were. Especially that guy. That's a guy I had to have. Whew. Thanks, buddy. No more action figures. At least right now, no more action figures. Where are we going, Steve? More kickboxing again. We just did kickboxing yeah. 12 hours ago. Yeah, yeah. Like it's like. How's the groin feel? Groin's fine. Right. Do you prefer your shorty shorts that you have on to the yes. to the onesie? Yes. I'm not gonna film any of this workout because it's just gonna be regular. But I'm not necessarily looking forward to it either. I've been this will be my sixth kickboxing of the week, and I'm feeling it. I mean, like not just like the muscles hurt, but the actual bones. Hey, here's some like my kneecap hurts. Well, here's some other things you gotta consider too. My tibia. And for me, it's I'm sore, and I don't. It was less than 12 hours ago. I stuffed my face with boneless wings. Yeah, you ate about 27 and boneless wings. My stomach's uncertain. Yeah. Have you doo dooed since the sweet and sour sauce cupcake boneless wings go through the light? I have. Did it feel good, or is it not big enough yet? I don't think it's big enough. Oh well, we're about to kickbox it. Steve, we're the only ones here. Okay, awesome. Oh dear. Are you ready? No. Over to your left foot. I don't like it. Steve, do you like it? No. No. Did you enjoy that? No. Are you glad it's over? Yes, I'm very glad. <laughs> Natalie picked up literally almost a ton of pavers that we have to put in the backyard. How does that make you feel? No. Are you upset with Natalie? You might get on punishment. It's gotta be done, it's gotta be done. It's gotta be done! Punishment, no. I don't know, Steve drove and I don't know what car he has right now. I'm delirious. I, I feel like I've got anal seepage if I'm honest with you. Oh no. Was that fun? No. <laughs> All right, Steve has to leave in like an hour and a half, so we gotta collect things. We're gonna go eat lunch somewhere quick. Natalie, with Natalie. Probably have to still be stinky. Yeah. Not have enough time to get clean. Just butt juices, yeah. maybe. Yeah. We'll see what's for lunch next. Oh, look at that nipple. Well, Steve, are you excited? Uh, Midnight train. We're right back at kickboxing. Mm -hmm. You ready? No, I'm not. Oh, we did get the clean up a little bit. We're going to go eat Mexican food because we only have like 45 minutes. And Mexican's usually pretty snappy. Pretty snappy. Now are you excited for Mexican food? I am. I am ravenously hungry somehow. I haven't eaten all day. I haven't eaten since the buffalo wing bonanza. Steve, did you ever push out them wings? I have not yeah. yet. Yeah. I have not yet. Oh boy. <laughs> Steve. I don't think they've had enough seduction. Big pile of corn. Mm -hmm. Are you excited, Steve? Are you gonna eat that pineapple? The little side pineapple they gave you? Probably not. I got some I'm steak and lettuce and oh feeling it. How's the food? It was good. I do have two more big packages. We should open them before you leave. Just real quick. I'm gonna open them. <laughs> horsey! Roach the horsey. So the horse came from GameStop along with this whole box. What do you think's in there, Steve? I just came from GameStop? Yeah, what do you think's in there? 
God. One should pick your head up. What's that? Can oh, we pull it out? Yeah, whip it out. Ooh. Oh. A giant gazillion. Giant gazillion premium bubble? Now look at this. Oh. Look at all those chickens. Goodness gracious, what are you army building? Oh. <laughs> Big troll giant man. Look at that face. Goodness. Oh. You like it? Uh, Unknown? Well, Steve's yeah, not into fantasy stuff. It's I'm not, not his tea. I'm not as much as... He likes to rub it. So, the horses, a uh, previous order. Those trolls are like 40 or 50 bucks retail price. Uh -huh. GameStop had them on sale for twenty four ninety each. Mm -hmm. Then GameStop also had the sale that if you spent $100, you got $25 off or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Remember that? Yeah, yeah. But they made them twenty four ninety. No, no. You had to spend one hundred twenty-five dollars to get twenty-five dollars off. Yeah, they made them twenty-four ninety each, which meant they came in fifty cents under to buy five of them. Fifty cents under, one hundred twenty-five dollars. So you got to find something that's like a dollar to add to it. So you get one gazillion bubbles, and it made those trolls nineteen bucks yeah, each. That's nicely done. Why did I get five of them? That's a good question that I don't have an answer for. But we gotta say goodbye to Steve. Steve's gotta go home. Yeah. Rufus is licking him in the package. All right, puppy. Yes. Thanks for coming, Steve. Yes. Did you enjoy the onesie? <sighs> no. How do your groin feel right now in your cheeks and hands? <sighs> well, they're better now, but they're still sore. sore. Yeah. yeah. We'll see Steve soon, hopefully. When we get closer to summer, and then it picks up. Yeah. And uh, he'll teabag it. Yeah? Mm, yeah. All right! And several hours later, I now have Kaya, and we're not teabagging it, Steve, but we are having bubble tea. Are you excited? And a little treat, little treat, little 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 date day, date day, little date day. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, well, she's not speaking to me, was she? No. no. I have peaches and cream. What's it called? Peaches slush and cream. What did you get? I got strawberry blossom with um, cherry blossom. And a cake and pie treat. Tiramisu. Tiramisu. Cheers. That tastes like summertime in Georgia. That's what that that's delicious. Taste that. It tastes like summertime in Georgia. Yep. Yummy. It's a little while later. Well, it's actually quite a while later. And I've just been opening up some toys, hanging with the puppy. I've got the Shadow Equidron Mythic Legion. I got the Forest Troll 2.0. The regular Equidron. What's it? Scaphoid and Tibius. Vetus. Sir Owain, the ogre. And then these I wanted to show you because these are custom heads, both from Nikki Nicole Customs. So I love that one. It's like the mouth of Soren. It's on this guy. You see, you can completely change the way he looks. And then this is like a Cthulhu squid head and it's on the scaphoid. She had it uh, color matched. I think it looks great. So just having fun, playing with toys, you know. Be in the bathroom for an hour oh longer gosh, than the movie. No, oh. oh no. Here's the Ultra Ego Vegeta head that came with that Kong Studios <laughs> S3 Vegeta reissue. She's so red right now. He's cool. He's cool. I like him. Alright, we're gonna eat some dinner uh, and we'll catch up to you when we get to Morbius for the movie, unless I open up those customs a little more, which is possible. Well, I just went ahead and opened them all. All the ones that I'm keeping. I've also packed up Ron's. Ron's keeping four. You'll see those on his channel. And David got the Skeletor and the Spike Ore. So I've got the Big Troll, the Buzz Off, that's a Triclops, Plundor, it's a Clamp Champ, Jitsu, Beast Man. Beast Man? Yeah, that's right. That's right. What's that guy's name? Double Trouble? No, it's not Double Trouble. What is that guy's name? But just look. Let me uh, pull it back and zoom in. Look at the details on these things. Hand painted. All sorts of custom work. Sculpting. Creating things from scratch. Absolutely amazing. Too bad. Too bad is his name. Nick also gave me 
two of these. That's kind of his logo. Mythics of the Universe is Nick Dubes. Um, for your shoelaces. So I think I put those on my big dub shoes, I believe. Look at all this mess that we've unboxed. Look at all this. This is ridiculous. Actually, I got the Goliath out. You see how big those wings are compared to these? Let's do that real quick. I got them there where you can see kind of the comparison of the wingspan. Even these are still big, but at least this is like a, a flexible, pliable material. I like it with the draped wings. I hope they make a down wing or something for all of them because it's just ridiculous having those great big wings and that being your only display option. Look at all this stuff. But now it's we're going to go to see Morbius in like an hour, and we'll check in there. We're not at Morbius yet, but I want to show you, even though I'm going to display the figures out of their package, their packaging is just so cool. I wanted to have it displayed, so I have it over here with my Lord of the Rings and my Eastman stuff because they're very special and they mean a lot and has a lot of memory. So even the empty packaging I want to display. We're about to leave. Bakaya is working on the Flame Toys Optimus Prime. Has this got paint on it? No. That's just the regular she's plastic. finished building the model, but she's working. She's weathering it for me, which is kind of hard to see. Yeah. Yeah, maybe that helps you see how she's scratching it, weathering it, putting damage on it. So whenever this is finished, we'll it's check it. It's quite fun. Now are you ready for Morbius? Yes. Okay, Hi, here we are. Sugarloaf Mills, AMC, are we excited? Yes. We gotta go, because the movie's about to start. We gotta walk like that dump. So, uh, you know, rub it. Yeah, I do have pretty bad gas. It's, yes. all good. it's, it's no good. It's no good. Ooh, how does that make you feel? Exciting. Safety. We're exiting the Theatra. The Theatra. Did you enjoy the movie, Kaya? Yes. Yes, she enjoyed the movie. Yes. Did you enjoy the movie, Natalie? Yeah. It's late. That was good. I enjoyed it. Had some cool effects. Set up some other things. You know, it's, it's, uh, we get used to these long movies. It's a short movie and it feels like it's missing about 20 minutes of movie. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I enjoyed it. It was good. No, it wasn't bad. It was an, a pleasant evening out with the family, which is what matters. Mm -hmm. So I, I'm going to be interested if they continue that story. Uh, I imagine a lot of people that are watching this hasn't seen it yet, since a lot of people didn't go see that movie, and you're waiting to watch it on, on uh, whatever, Netflix. So I won't, we won't talk much about it, but it's worth watching. It's good. I had cool effects. I would see it in the big screen. We have the AMC membership, so we just get to go see it. It's great. Good times. Cool camera angles. Yeah, there was. There was a lot of cool camera angles. Similar. It's very similar to Venom yeah. in the way they shoot certain things. Uh I've had terrible gas. And I got a poop and hadn't come out. Hadn't come out in a day and a half. It's no good. Tomorrow's Easter, so we'll check in with you tomorrow. I lied to put Kai's Easter basket out. So we got four different Pokemon sets. We got his Anetsu sword. We got this Pokemon set. Rufus is squeaking it. Got her some of those. She wanted. Some of those. 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 And can I get this out one moment? And those. Isn't that right, Rufus? Now I'm going to go to bed. You ready, puppy? Yes. Something came off on the forehead. It's yeah. the next day, next morning. Or Victoria's house, magically. Hey. Look, why do you need a little dog area? Well, you know. Secrets for future episodes of Double A. Maybe. Uh, so we are about to go to church. We are here with Victoria at her house, and we have an Easter dinner. We saw Morbius last night, Victoria. Cool. Um, There's a lot of Jared Leto, like shirtless, yeah. both uh, very skinny and then jacked. Oh, that's interesting. When he becomes a vampire, and he's like, uh, yeah, 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 big boy. Uh, and we learned this morning that you don't want your teeth tilly tinky to go in the vice grip. No. It's after church. Dancing for after church. This is what we're having for Easter dinner? Come no, on. we're having more than just eggs. Just a big pile of eggs. We're just we're about to fill them. With chocolate? No. Oh. I said I'm going to try one of these to see if they're not po poison. You said, can I, can, I, can you? Yeah. But what if they're poison? And the child has died at Easter. <sighs> I got to try them. I, I have a life insurance policy. You don't. 
You can try it and then I can try it. <laughs> Twenty dollars? I'll do that for twenty dollars. Exactly. That's not very much. You need I to dilute know. it with water. Oh. You need to put it in a cup with water. Oh no. No. No, I think she should just lima drink beans. it. Me, I eat lima beans. Here's the eggs. Is it a toucan or one can? It's a toucan. Toucan Sam. No, don't do it with water though. Oh. Too bad. Just dump it in. Dump it in. Oh, I don't want to look at that. <laughs> Oh. You're drinking that for $20? Yes. That's just nothing. There's, that's not very much it's at egg all. egg juice, though. I mean, that's not. I'm not the one giving you $20. Don't look at me. All if, you, if you throw up, you lost like $20. It's water. It's just water. Yeah, it's just not, not going to taste like anything. <laughs> that tastes like something. Did you get it? Oh. I want that. Oh. Easter supper, Victoria. Yeah. Are you gonna end on the dressing? I like Parmesan. Victoria. Yes. Are you interested in flea market madness? No, I don't think so. Oh well, happy Easter. <laughs> oh, we're back home. Rufus is uh, <laughs> oh, okay. He was looking his thing. Uh, we're back home. I didn't feel much at Easter because I'm just trying to spend family, do family time. But we'll see Kai get her uh, Easter presents here in just a moment. Natalie, you know how. This bag right here, if we shake it, Rufus comes running over no matter where he is. Yep, oh, yep. See, if we shake it, Rufus comes running over no matter where he is. <coughs> See, if he wants a chip. Do you think if we somehow say like, Easter basket, Kyle will come running the way Rufus does? Alexa, make an announcement. I'm opening up an Easter basket. Ooh la la, it's all mine. Hooray. Announcing. You think she's gonna come running the way that Rufus does when he hears that bag of chicken chips? Well, let's see. Rufus, what do you think? Oh, I hear footsteps. Think somebody's coming running like the uh, chicken chip scenario? I mean, it sounds like an elephant is coming. That's what it sounds like. Huh? I'm not an elephant. Oh. All right. So this side is Rufus's Easter basket, and that's yours. Wait, are there customs in this? No, I've put the customs in the case. These are a regular release. Well, they they all custom. look really cool, though. All regular right. Release. So you want me to put these all on the floor for Rufus? I'm not sure. Wouldn't he, like... I mean, either he, his. He can do what Pokemon he wants. Cards. No, maybe but he knows how to win. What do you want? What do you want to look at? Which which box do you want first? Um. I guess you already see what everything is. Kind of. Do you okay. like your Easter basket? Yes, Unknown. I do. I, I, so far, from what I see, yes. What are those? Oh. Oh. But not like she likes those. No, I don't have any orange. Mm -hmm. Oh, they have spiders on them. Oh, looks like they kind of glow in the dark too a little bit. Mm. Really? The souls. That's cool. Ooh, spooky. So are they like Halloween? Halloween dunks? Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh. Yeah, because it has like a bunch of eyes like uh -huh. on the side. I have a well. pair too, so we can be matching. Oh, next look at that. What do you think hey, about it, Rufus? I got a pair in my Easter basket. Yes. Oh. Rufus is like, where's mine? Well, you got that pumpkin and we'll give you a marshmallow. Is there a marshmallow left? Rufus, mm -hmm. I'm sorry. We won't give you a marshmallow, but I ordered you 24 pumpkins. We have uh, more? Yeah. We already have four bags in the thing. Uh-oh, Rufus, I thought we were out. Now we're going to have a lot more. <laughs> what are you going to open now? Uh, that one? You think she's going to like? Yes. Oh, uh -oh. I like that. It looks like Neapolitan ice cream. I think that is considered the Neapolitan. Look at the bottom. It's got the recycled soul like you like. Yay, that's great. And I also got a pair so we can be matchy matchy. <laughs> this is very matchy matchy. Oh, first like, give me the food. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. <laughs> All right. You're going to give the rest to Rufus now? Okay, I'll 
I'll take these though. If they're my size, won't they be too big? I mean, I can just wear two pairs of socks. Oh, are you gonna open them or what? Okay. Or you want to open one of the other ones? I was going to save these. You can save them for last? You can save them for last. Whip them out. I'm interested in what you are going to whip out next. What do you think that is? Converse. Oh, well, yeah. That's probably safe. But... Oh, they're purple! They're purple Converse. I love purple. Just figure it out as puzzle. Getting some food. Puzzling it. Purple is awesome. Look how nasty our floor is. We just had it clean too. Yeah. Rufus old stank booty Rufus. Yay. 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 All right, next one. <gasps> They're the hot ankle ones. Yeah, they are. Yay. I'm very excited about this. I was just going to want those more than any other one. <laughs> I'm very happy. I don't know. So you think mom should just keep that box without you even seeing what's in there? The other one? Um. <laughs> or maybe we should look. If mom wants. Rufus, you got to go poo-poo? She can. You may have to go poo-poo. Come on. Let's go outside. Let's see if he's got to go poo-poo. Let's go outside together and see if he's got a poo-poo. One, two, three. Okay. Go. Yay. I'm going to film Rufus dumping. Looks like he's got to go poo-poo. I mean, that's a. He hadn't pooped all day because we were gone for Easter. That's a significant poop. It's a big one. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm just. Oh, oh, double deuce. He's like, yeah, that's right. I'm coming. I'm actually. <clears throat> Rufus let it ride. Two and a half dumps Rufus took. Are you going to trade these for the dumps Rufus took? No, thank you. Oh. Oh, that's cool. It's like a mix of my other two. The zebras. That's cool. I like that. Are you going to wear those to school tomorrow? Are you going to flex on them with your Easter zebras? I might wear them to school tomorrow because they look cool. You like the different tones of the whites? I like the different tones of whites on the zebra. Oh, yeah. It has a metallic white. Like, white. On well, and you got, I mean, I'm shocked that we can see how Zanetsu is no longer her bay anymore. No, she no, just no. doesn't care that there's no. a Zanetsu. I was going to get to that. Is that made by the same people who made the other one? Yeah. So it has like sound and stuff? Yeah. You want to whip it out? Maybe. You want to give mom all your shoes in exchange for it? Let's see. <laughs> we'll see if she's a teenager or not. <laughs> if you got to pick between your Yeezy zebras and your that. We've become a teenager, I think. Mm -hmm. Ooh, you want to have both? If that's okay. All right. What? Okay, well that's it. That's <laughs> no. that's what you were showing us. I'll go ahead to Rufus. Oh, Rufus picked the worm up again. He's chewing on it. Oh, good. Those worm treats you. Ro that's not the way Zanetsu swings it. He oh. does like the take a dump thing. Yeah, like he's pooping. Yeah. Pooping while he's running. Pooping while he's yeah, pooping while he's running. Pinch one out. <laughs> oh, almost. almost hit me in the in the oh. tea till it pinky. I'm so sorry. Well, I mean, you know, no vice grip or nothing. <laughs> You know who also has zebras that you can be twinsies with? Uh, <laughs> Me! Well, that's bare feet. I have zebras. Yay! That's not... She doesn't. Do you see how excited she got that she gets to be tw foot Ooh. twinsies with you? But we opened two pairs of shoes today. Look how pretty Natalie looks for Easter. To be twinsies with yeah. me and she's like, oh. Yes, we know. She's getting strong. Mm. Mm -hmm. it's hard to find. She's in like Brian's size, so it's great. You saying I got big feet? I think that's what oh. she's saying. Look, I just went to Jamaica and ate a little bit. Like I'll work on it. I'm working on it. She's roasting both of us. No. Squeeze it. <laughs>